Prince Andrew is determined he needs a very big house as experts doubt he will ever leave the lodge. One royal commentator said Prince Andrew is defiant and insists he needs a very big house. Royal commentators have claimed that Prince Andrew may never leave his home at the Royal Lodge. Welcome to Royal Expert, if you're new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any news about the British royal family. Royally Obsessed Podcast co-host Rachel Bowie said she was left wondering if the Duke of York would ever leave the £30 million property he has lived in since 2003 given the recent headlines. The Royal Lodge is said to have been a bone of contention between the 63-year-old prince and his older brother as King Charles wants him and his ex-wife Sarah Ferguson to vacate the property as part of plans for a slim monarchy. However, the discussions reportedly subsided last month as the Duchess of York underwent an eight-hour mastectomy and reconstructive surgery after being diagnosed with breast cancer during a routine mammogram. Although the Yorks are allowed to stay for the time being, the 74-year-old monarch appears not to have changed his mind but Andrew hasn't either, with the Duke reportedly digging his heels in, insisting that he needed the 30-room palace. The King and Prince William have now joined forces to try to drop the Duke's peg or two as the Fatherson duo have reportedly renewed their efforts to try to evict the Duke of York from the royal residence on Windsor Estate by September. However, Ms. Bowie, Senior Director of Special Projects and the family who owns PureWow.com, told the Royally Obsessed podcast that she doubts this will pay off. Speaking about the latest episode, which was released on July 27, she said, Apparently, Charles has expanded his ability to be there a little bit longer because of Fergie's battle with breast cancer which is kind of king. But I'm just like is Andrew going to leave one day? He seems to keep insisting he needs a very big house. Likewise, royal biographer Andrew Looney, who is currently writing a book on the prince, also doubts the Royal Lodge will ever see his back. Quoting Entertainment Daily, Mr. Looney said, Andrew is digging his heels in its part of a broader game of power and status with Charles. The optics don't look good, but that won't worry Andrew. I never see him leave. Charles and William have joined forces to drop him off a peg or two and try to keep him and his family under the radar because, as the future of the monarchy, they have a lot to lose because of his antics. Andrew has lived at the Royal Lodge for two decades, signing a 75-year lease in 2003. Since then he has reportedly spent £7.5 million refurbishing the property and renting it out at £250 a week. It has been suggested that he could move to Frogwar Cottage, the former home of the Sussexes, also on the Windsor estate. Thanks for watching till the end.